We were on the Labrador Coastal Drive, exploring the communities that dotted the southeast corner of Labrador. We began the day at Forto, along the shores of Forto Bay. We had stayed at the Grenfell Louis A. Hall Bed and Breakfast Inn, which used to be the old Forto Nursing Station. At the Forto dock, men were filling the plastic tubs full of ice, ready to stand by to receive the day's catch. In prehistoric times, there is also evidence that Aboriginal people settled in the area attracted to the harbour and marine life. Fishing and whaling have been part of the Porto region since the 16th century. In the 18th century, Porto became the largest English fish and fur station in Labrador, as more shore workers and craftspeople arrived in the 19th century, a permanent settlement grew. Towards the end of the day, we stopped at the Point Amour Lighthouse Historic Site, Atlantic Canada's tallest lighthouse, completed in 1857. Arriving at Lansamore on the right. was also home to a Marconi station, operating as a transatlantic wireless telegraph station. It also enabled the transmission of messages back and forth between Labrador and Newfoundland. 